Hi YouTube, this is Born with a Veil. This is Cancer's reading for June the 1st to June the 16th, 2019. Love reading, relationship reading. God knows what will come out of this reading. So, Cancer's female and males are very passionate um, about their life, about their sex life, about the person that they love. They're very passionate about it. They're very good in bed. Um... They got the bomb sex. Um, cancer, it's time to free yourself. You have to take back your life. You're not taking back your life like you should. Cancer, you still have some red flags. You still have red flags. And you know it. You know it. You know, um, what is it that you're hiding, Cancer? What is it that you're not telling? Because you're not telling everything. And this is the truth. Cancers are very sneaky and they hold shit in. Why aren't you being truthful? What is it that you're hiding? You're hiding some deep, dark secrets. Also, cancers are very magical. They're into black magic, good magic. Uh, a lot of cancers um, are psychic, astrologers. Um, but you can fool other people, but you can't fool me. And you can't fool yourself, uh, cancer. I'm telling you, there's some shit up with you. Seriously. Um, healing. Like, once again, you know, cancer gets this card again. There's a lot of shit going on within your family. And maybe some of you are mad at your parents. Maybe you don't feel like your parents have been there. Maybe you've lost both parents or one. Um, you're not getting along with siblings. I mean, there's a lot of shit going on within your family, within yourself. You guys got to get it together. Uh, Cancer, you got to open up your mind. I'm still telling you, and I don't give a damn. There is a man that's talking to two females. And I feel like some Cancers are promising love to two people, two men or two women. And I believe that some Cancers are engaged to two people. And, and, and they, they're lying. To, and I'm telling you, these women are going to come together, or these men are going to come together, and they're going to figure this shit out. Cancer, you're going to get caught in your shit. I'm telling you. Um, codependency. Um, a lot of you have stopped drinking. Overeating. Um, you care about yourself more. Maybe you're on a diet. Maybe you're exercising more. Um, maybe you're letting not food control you so more. Liquor not controlling you anymore. Um, maybe you're trying to change your lifestyle. There is a true love for you there. And you deserve love. But once again, once again, keep an open mind in true love. There's somebody that you love, Cancer, but you talk it to two people. What is up with that? You think that you're being smart. I'm telling you, you're not. One knows and one doesn't. And that one that knows is going to whoop that ass in the oven. When she finds out, she's going to go off. You're going to have a big problem on your hands. That's either uh, two women or two men. Seriously. And this is going to happen very soon. You're going to get caught up in your shit, uh, Cancer. For real. You've been praying for a soulmate. You got your soulmate. What's the problem? And see, here we go. Now, you see this one getting to know each other? Let me let me get this card. <laughs> yeah, you getting to you getting to know them all right cuz uh there's the two women. You talking to two people. And the one knows it, she knows it. And the other one don't know shit. And you got them both falling in love with you. Either two men or two women. I'm telling you, you better cut that shit out. They're going to whoop your ass. Um, and this other person could be a water sign. Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. One is an earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. The other one, water all around your ass. Um, you messing with fire 
and there's somebody that the other woman that you're talking to other man they're different from the person that man or woman that you're in love with either there's something about um they're mixed with something they're a different nationality they're light skin um there's there's some shit going on yes i'm telling you now you're going to marry the one that you're truly in love with, but you're still talking to that other person. For real. I'm serious. Because you have romantic feelings for both of them. You're going to get caught up in your shit. You watch what I tell you. Watch what I tell you, Cancer. Watch what I tell you. You express your love to this one particular man or woman all the time. Um, one of the people that you're talking to either a uh, water sign another water sign or uh earth sign has children or they both do or one does um wow right now your fancy your finances or career are affecting your relationship because some of you are not working or um you're laid off so a lot of you are working but some of you are not that's affecting your shit. You say the one that you're in love with could be the one, right? He or she was worth waiting for. You're trying to hang in there and give your relationship a chance. You're trying to stay optimistic. Um, you want to marry this person. But you're still talking to two damn people. You're supposed to love yourself first, but a lot of you don't. And some of you are narcissists. Water signs are narcissists too. Um, let go of control issues. Either you're with someone controlling or you're trying to control. So these two people can't come into contact. But they're going to come in contact. They're going to find your ass out. And you're playing too damn much, Cancer. The chemistry is hot. You got to forgive and, and learn from your forgiving. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present. You guys have not let your past go, a lot of you. You could talk to friends about your shit. They'll listen to you. But will you tell them the real deal about your ass? Release your ex. Some of you have been in contact with people that you've known from your past. And you're in this love here. The one that you really love, she you think she don't know, but she knows. Some of you were married before. And I'm going to tell you something. Cancers flirt a lot with other people. Sorry, but it's the truth. And that's why you have so many heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Because you're full of shit sometimes. And that's why they don't trust you. And you've had a past relationship with the person that you're in love with. Not the other bitch. Um, this one that you're in love with, she's your soulmate. And a lot of you are engaged. And. But then there was a new love coming in. <laughs> um, some of you people cancers or that don't have anybody. A new love is coming in. And you're really going to be in love. But you got to make the effort. Because um, some of you, the cancers that are single, you're going to meet somebody. But you got to make an effort to love them. There's going to be attraction if you're single. Um, if you're in a relationship, you guys are separated right now from a water sign or earth sign. It's safe for you to love again if you're single, cancer. And I'm telling you, somebody, somebody from your past is coming back. They're going to want to reconcile with you. Are you going to take this offer or not? What are you going to do? Some of you that are single are going to meet one, two, three, four, five, six, seven people. The world is yours, but what are you going to do with it, Cancer? Are you going to keep lying to these two people? Your health is pretty good. you got aches and pains, just like everybody else. But... You could win in this situation, the Empress. Um, your family is really in your um, in your life. A lot of shit going on. And six of one, good news is coming in about a job. Um, a lot of you get promoted. This is born with a veil. God bless.